Well, here we go again. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. I'm really excited for you guys to see episode four because you're gonna get to see what's behind this door right here. Uh, but until then. Recently, I got to sit down with the lead singer of 333, which is also the lead singer of the famous rock band Push Monkey, and we got to talk a little bit and had a little interview. Now, I can't show all of that interview because the interview ended up lasting like 41 minutes, but I'm considering putting it into my Patreon account that I'll do, I don't know, probably like next year or so. But meanwhile, check out this little clip of the interview that we did over at his place whenever we were working on some 333 tunes. To talk about Push Monkey for a second, being in the 20-something on the billboard, that's still a, a huge deal. Yeah, the song was called Hand Slide. In 99, we went on tour with Ozfest. We went on tour with Godsmack. Because when we started out, we were on the same level as Godsmack. I'm a huge fan of yours. How you wrote Melodies and Push Monkey, and how that compares and contrasts in 333. So, it's really not that different. So where 333 is, is the final result of all the difficulty that Push Monkey went through. As a lead singer and as a lyricist, I was very interested in sort of the art. So today was a classic example of how hectic my schedule can be and how bam, 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 bam it is. I uh, had a bunch of lessons this morning and then I had a bunch of errands and everything was just back to back and now I'm here for the podcast. Say hi to Kristen. Hi. <laughs> Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun, so make sure you check out. I'll put a link in the description. Bye. Oh no, we got. Uh, am I going to be on the vlogs? You're going to have to be on the, the vlog. vlog. Yeah. What's the going on? Guys, check out his. Uh, check it out, baby. Space here. This is where we do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This do is it, the it. Cobra Cast. We're going to have a good time. Oh yeah, we are. So I want to give a very special thank you to this girl back here. Hi. Um, she's been a huge, huge help. Um, as a lot of you know, I've been telling you that I'm extremely new to this whole singer front guy thing. And if it wasn't for this girl, let me point them backwards, there we go. This girl right here, I wouldn't be able to do it. She has helped me so much with whether it's advice or just support or encouragement. This girl is a true rock star. So make sure you follow her. I'm gonna give you some links in the description on how to follow her. She's actually a, a life coach and she works on positive vibes. Uh, anything you wanna add to that or or just look you up or um yeah you can look me up on facebook kristen menendez or virtuous reality is my virtuous reality.com is my website love and relationship coach i specialize in working with empaths people who identify as highly sensitive people um but yeah that's what i do yeah i'll leave uh links to all that stuff in the description so make sure you check her out and show her some love so everyone's always giving me a hard time about my car and how small it is, but how much music gear I fit in it. So I wanted to show you guys kind of the puzzle, how to put everything in a small Mazda car. I'm gonna race the dogs today. I'm gonna go all the way down there to the end of that sidewalk, and I'm gonna have them sit and stay, then I'm gonna come all the way over here. Then I'll say, wait, ready, go. And when I snap my fingers, they're gonna run towards me. And last time it was Harley who won, so let's see if Macy can redeem herself. So the trick is getting them to sit and stay for this long. We're coming all the way down here, and it's a long walk. It's it's. A good 20, 30 seconds of walking back that they have to sit and stay. Meanwhile, I'm getting farther and farther away from them. So 
short seat how they do? Stay. Ready, go! And it's Macy! Oh, that's good girls! Macy won! Macy won! Oh, good girls. Harley's not happy about it. Well, you won last time. Good girl. Well, Macy won, and I got that on film, but Harley did win last time to her defense. Give it up for Cheve, one of my first students in Austin. And not only is he one of the first that I got in Austin, Texas, he's actually the first one that I produced an original song. On my very first CD release that I did about three years ago, he was the only one who had an original song. And you will hear that in my next vlog on the Anxiety Vlog. I'm gonna kind of feature his song because it's a truly inspirational and a wonderful ballad. Didn't he do an amazing job? Well, it's time to head out east and see some family. Welcome to Stringer, Mississippi, about a hundred miles outside of the middle of nowhere. I learn how to do a lot of stuff every time I visit there. We always piddle around with something, whether it's working on my car or working on one of the little vehicles that he has. He has these little tractors and everything that he kind of soups up that I get to drive around. He, you know, teaches me how to work on little things here and there, so it's always a ton of fun. Another thing my cousin does is he's a pretty accomplished woodworker as well. And he builds these cigar box guitars. Check this out, freaking awesome, right? This is one that he custom built for me, for me to use, and I'm gonna put it in a song one of these days and show you guys how good it sounds. We did some really good electrical work to it, and it has some amazing Fender pickups. Just an awesome job. So to tell you the truth, I am really excited to be doing so many different styles of vlogging with these episodes. It's been a ton of fun. Sometimes I'm driving, sometimes I'm in my office, sometimes I'm on a location of whatever I'm talking about. But I hope you guys have enjoyed what I'm showing you as I go along with all of this. By this point, you guys have seen some of my past, some of the things that I'm going through now. What are some things that you want to see? What are some things you want to see more, you know, in depth topics of? What are some things that I need to talk about more? Some things you don't like seeing? Let me know down in the comments some things that you want to do because after all, I mean, this is, yeah, that's, it's my vlog and, and I'm enjoying what I'm doing, but it's really for you guys. I'm trying to build a community here and, and together I want this to be the best vlog it can be. So I keep bringing up all these secrets that I want to share with you and one in particular I'm extremely nervous about but I'm so super passionate. Today I have a couple of lessons and then I'm going to tend to that secret for a little bit before I end up having a show this evening. So I have to keep telling myself that as nervous as I am it's still one of my biggest passions. So I have to bring you guys along if I'm going to end up showing you all of this stuff. Alright guys. That is the end of episode three.
Be sure to like and subscribe so you can see when episode four comes out. Your love and support has been amazing. I can't thank you enough for everything that you guys are doing for me. But as for me, it's time to go to the gym. La 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 la.